for joining me. I'm Kenny, aka Meet the Ghost, and today we're gonna try out some new sandwiches that um, Burger King came out with. Um, I didn't see a burger version. It's um, so far it's been chicken sandwiches. So we got um, a few different chicken sandwiches to showcase today. Um, there is a Mexican original chicken sandwich, and and an American original chicken sandwich. So, to showcase the difference between the sandwiches, we actually got all three. <laughs> because there is an original chicken sandwich. Um, so, I believe this is the original. We got that long bun. Mayonnaise and maybe some lettuce. That's the typical one that you know, it's there all the time, and sometimes they turn that into the uh, chicken parmesan where they put on tomato sauce and cheese. Um, so this one, I believe, is the Mexican. And this has spicy queso and jalapenos. So I'm gonna pop the bun on out. Oh, it's jalapeno crispies! And a uh, spicy queso. Okay, and the American. So this looks like it's the original, just as a uh, deluxe. It's got cheese, tomato, ket um, lettuce, mayonnaise. Alrighty. So, since we've already know what the other one tastes like, I just wanted to show you it so you know you can see. The difference between the three. Um, I think I want to start with the Mexican first. So on my first bite, I didn't get much of the jalapeno crisp. But I got a lot of the queso. So it's actually a liquid um, or a, a, like a whiz cheese. It's got a mild um, zing to it. Honestly, I don't really like... Uh, well, it, how can you... Crispies are coming out of the sandwich. <laughs> I don't really like um, cheese on chicken. But sometimes it's good. Um, this one right here, it works pretty well together. The patty is, you know, it's typical um, Burger King chicken. But let's see if I can get a better bite with uh, more of that jalapeno crispies. I think that they should have done is uh, put down the queso first, then the jalapeno, and then the patty. So that way the cheese will make it stick. Because um, it looks like they put the cheese the patty and then the jalapeno crispers and the crispers says there's nothing binding them they just fall them out mm. the crispers add a little crunch to it and I guess a little heat, but not much more than an onion. It's not bad. Not bad. Mmm. I made a mess. Um, one moment. What do with these crispers? Now let's go on to the American version. The good news is that the uh, when they added the cheese, it looks like the patty was hot because the cheese is melted really well onto the chicken. But you can still tell that it's a sliced cheese. Hmm. I didn't get much of anything off of that first bite. I 
okay. On the second bite, I got everything. The mayonnaise, the cheese, the tomato, and the lettuce. It's not bad. Um, personally, I think I, pro I probably would prefer to leave out the cheese and the mayonnaise. But um, I got it as was because, um, you know, I wanted to showcase the actual sandwich. But, um... It's not bad. It's not bad. I mean, I like vegetables. Mm, between the two, which would I say is the better one? If you like a more filling sandwich, I'd say it's the American. But if you like um, a more zing to your taste, then it's the Mexican. Um, both of them, they seem... A little above standard fare, so I'd say they're probably about maybe I give it like a rating about maybe a six and a half of each. Um, I guess it's just what you would rather have um, a more like filling chicken deluxe <laughs> or um, one that has just uh, queso and jalapeno, uh, little crispies. But yeah. It's uh, it's not so bad. They're pretty. They're they're decent. They're would I get them again? Maybe, but I wouldn't be in a rush. You know, it's not like I have to have it. Um, so I think six and a half is fair for a rating for these. Um, but yeah, thank you guys for joining me. You guys have a great day.